what's up guys? This is the Rifleman and I am back to bring you to the next episode of my Empire Dead War. Let's play as the Kingdom of Portugal. And in this, this episode we're going to be doing a lot of damage to the Austrian Empire. We're capturing a number of their key cities. But first of all, we have to knock out the garrison here at, here at Sofia. And they have lots of artillery, so we'll need to rush forward as quickly as possible and overwhelm them with our infantry. Then we'll secure the territory and then likely fight the Transylvania battle afterwards. I think the, this army, once it's done its job, it will probably be routed northward. Um, so it could either be used against the Saxons down the line, or it could be used against Sweden. But for now, we're going to focus on <laughs> focus on squashing the Austrian Empire. Although, it's funny really that the once I knock out Austria, the three remaining factions are going to be um, Savoy, Saxony, and Sweden. All the S's. So we've got some rain. Let's drop the artillery, foot artillery on this high ground. They should be able to engage the enemy there. Now oh, it's uh, just... They're going to apply a round shot into the enemy artillery, but they've got these features up front, which means we're probably going to have to split our forces and go um, push both directions at once. They've not got very much infantry, so neither one of our um, forces are going to be vulnerable. The cavalry can stay more central. Yeah, they're all... They're all going to deploy up on the high ground. Deploy one. My artillery can shoot at whatever they like. It's going to be focusing on the artillery in the center. Yeah. Let's just get my Hussars and Lancer Guards out on one flank. Get my Household Cavalry out here. And the full artillery can just try and try and engage enemy infantry positions. Although you are trying to bring down the town. Trying to bring down the uh, building. Get the howitzers to work on the mortars and the heavy howitzer artillery. They're consolidating towards the back. So let's position a unit of expat infantry just to begin Tritting them. New men. Push up. So this cavalry is going after the mortars. I mean, my infantry is going to be very tired by the time it gets over here. So let's make sure my general is over here to keep them. Spiffy. Okay, actually, let's get my cowards just to bombard the enemy infantry positions themselves. Get my hussars out of the way, because they're going to have to run through the enemy infantry to get there. Let's just use my household cavalry. Even a tired, but they're only artillery. It's an even on to the eighth. Cavalry keep engaging. There we go, they are engaging us, but we will soon deal with them. Push on to the 8-inch mortar garrison unit. Well, the infantry may actually go here and try and block the enemy from interfering with my cavalry. They're very tired. But here we go. 
one there. No, nope, we're all good. And that goes the enemy infantry, or some of it. Storm up the hill. It looks like we can get a pretty good surround off. Position, you may well route. But you start engaging the Fusiliers. Howitz has engaged the militia, engage that militia. There you go, proper fire by rank. Oh, you may have stood up. Third rank, get him. Got one of them. Fusilier is the only unit. Oh, I thought they were the only unit. The ninth is still here. But they're not in a real formation. And once these guys get into position, they are going to be very upset. Artillery cease fire. The officer had to go with his pistol. I heard it. There they go. That's right, you fellows. You, you all winded. My fellows have had to run up a hill to try and kill you. But to kill them, they did. Excellent. 100 men lost. So let's repair Sophia. Build the mine. You're mostly Catholic, but the Austrian priest will be, will be gone soon. So let's keep bringing you to the true faith. Let's build a cotton work, a craft workshop just to uh, support that. Let's get some ports built. That means Crimea, you build two sloops. You can build two sloops in one turn. Perfect. Okay, so we're going to get. Okay, we need to figure out how we're going to do this. I mean, just go toward Warsaw, that's a good holding point. They can either go east against Sweden, across the Baltic against Sweden, or west against Saxony. Now, we're not going to push on Zagreb, not until this force is replenished. Everyone's storming up towards Sarajevo. They'll take in Belgrade, spies, push up towards Berlin. Uh, you men, let's attack Klausenberg. Yet another... Austrian territory that's very, very undeveloped. So it was not really helping them in the way that they would, that they needed. Uh, but yeah, they have been surrounded. They will be destroyed. And then we'll move on to maybe Savoy. It depends on how the alliances work out. Who's the best one? Ah, oh, you poor souls. Poor, poor souls. Form the gun line and advance. The enemy are full of depleted infantry. This is not going to go well for them. So much good stuff. Get my general involved. Let's watch our artillery do glorious work. Pick, just pick targets. Some for... Yeah, it's a full garrison unit. You can bombard them with my heavy artillery. Position. 
Bring my Cossier across. Nah, it doesn't really matter. Oh, they are charging. Oh, my line just halt. There we go. Just halt, halt components of my line. They've gunned them down. Quick climb, <laughs> quick climb come in. Household cavalry get in behind them. Let's get my howitzers switched around shot because I think quick climb is going to be very much and not, not very much not necessary. Let's pivot you so you more deliberately focus on the line. Have recharged in? General's bodyguard, it's fine. Only job is to shatter. All oh, batteries engaged the 24th regiment. Oh, they tried to charge in. So did you know what? That's a terrible idea. Scatter to the four winds. And that was a devastating first blow. Killed a lot of good Austrians there. But that's another territory secured. Klausenberg is ours. Killed the magistrate. Yeah, you've still got a bunch of Orthodox and Protestants running around. Let's get a church skill. You don't, you don't even build the basic mines. You're positioning up towards uh, Hungary, so that's fine. I'm content to let them let them rot in Vienna. Just make sure that you're replenishing. Make sure that Mr. Pinto is replenishing. Make sure you are. You, yeah, yeah, you're coming in as reserves. Let's take out Prague. So Prague, we will likely fortify as a frontier town ready to jump onto Dresden. Just in case they attempt to uh, take take advantage, and take the initiative rather, and attack us, we want Prague to be ready to defend itself. Okay, the town the territory's undulating. Excellent position for artillery. There we go. Let me get I'm getting a bit paranoid about sounds here. Because I have played before and it's for some reason just turned settings off. Which I have not had any involvement in. That was a bit funky. Getting the grenadiers together because they're the same size. Lancer guards and sharpshooters. Yusier, Sars. So many howitzers. Open up with the climb. I got them, I got them quick enough. Grapnel shot. Boom, 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 boom. We killed 50 of them with that initial salvo. Too bad we didn't get any audio, but there we go. They decided actually that's really bad. Let's not let's not stick around. Two units bombard the light horse. You bombard the armed citizenry. Push forward. This is just this is just mean. Cavalry push around the edges. The mortars are upset. 
mean, the Hussars is their general, so they might not really want to get them involved. Let's maybe actually focus on... Some shells are down. But I figure I've got a really strong cavalry wing, so why focus, or why worry, or spend that much effort onto... onto their general, when I've got plenty of cavalry to do the same job. Down to 75 men. Excellent. So you men secure the secure the alley. Sharp shoots up first because they can choose to try and engage the enemy light horse. Shoot him! Get out your carbines. Forming up nicely. Jesus. Everyone's gone. Give the cavalry something to do. Focus all my artillery on that last infantry unit that's currently unengaged. Yeah, like like that. <laughs> that's what I really didn't want to see, but there we go, that's what we got. Didn't actually do that much damage to me. Fifteen. 15 sharpshooters, 9 lancers, that came out of that pretty easy. Cavalry broke the militia. Now just shatter them, push on into the 17th Regiment of Militia. Oh, they broke. Gang up on him. Same with this cavalry coming from the other direction. Oh, my artillery ceasefire. So they're shaken, but they think, don't worry, we can hold them off. We've got a couple of leakers. We've got a the trump just behind our lines. That's okay. We can work. We can manage that. Manage that. Here comes more cavalry. Slice them up from the rear. They do not like that. Do not like that at all. Uh, I wonder if I can. So I've got a prompt for uh, a delivery that you can't see. If I click X here. There we go. Yeah, so I, in my head I was going, if I click X, will, will everything work out and OBS will continue recording the game? And the answer was no. But still, the notification is gone. Yeah, I've got some furniture arriving. Upgrade. Oh, upgrade the boarding house, that's fine. Upgrade the roads. Now you're up strength, Bavaria. They still don't like the idea of being unguarded. Württemberg can handle it. So you men guard Munich, you men push out of Alsace Lorraine. Then you guys head towards head towards here. So if once if an army can jump on Berlin uh, Dresden, then the other army can push up and take Berlin. Then it all comes down to an army being ready here, which I'm gonna redirect you from the Austria fight. Ready to jump on Breslau. Excellent. And then the other fight we've got going on is the Hold Genoese in Bastia. Let's go get them. Let's pull them out of their misery. And then these forces in Genoa will be redirected to fight against Savoy. Landing troops all along the coast. So they can't. We can jump on both ends of their empire pretty easily. 
It is the central armies, central territory of Cairo, on the north, on the North African coast. They were actually, uh, we will actually struggle with, well, struggle in quotes. If they've not protected the port, we could potentially just sail straight in and land an army and run down and take it. But uh, yeah, let's not prejudice the output too much. Artillery on the slight high ground in the centre. How it says up close. Pick everybody except the garrison guards. Garrison guards form up on the right. All my cavalry is going to just kind of hold and see what the enemy does. Go right at the back. Punch up with the line. Yeah, I'm going to let them come to me. Otherwise, it'll just get silly. Yeah, I might divvy my cavalry up. It'll probably be a good hedge against against their supporting armies coming in. Well, howitzers are opening up now, so they're going to start to uh, do a bounce and shot. Hit ground here, bounced up and smashed straight into the citizenry. Very nice. Let's use the howitzers to actually land shots against their larger units, get my foot artillery. Well, they can shoot whoever they like, but we want to get into a position where we push some of the enemy units back so that we can see where their reinforcements come in from. See if we get screwed over. Run, men! Just run, just so they don't get their horses shot out from under them. Balance of power is in my favour. Good, I should hope so. A couple of volleys and these guys will be done for. Hey, they got fingerless gloves on. Like an army of hobos. Oh, here comes provincial cav unit. My carabiner are ready to meet you. You may be what gives us the first opportunity to see where the enemy comes in. And the 27 foot guards and the 49th foot guards are ready to respond if you make it closer in. There we go. <laughs> Shot the trump to mid trump. The 19th are ready. To receive the same welcome. Everybody make ready. Oh, there goes the officer. He's been shot out of the saddle. You. Such slaughter. My general can hardly believe it. And here comes their infantry block. Two cavalrymen left. Six cavalrymen left. Okay, the... Oh, excellent hit. I mean, my they can just shoot whatever they like. The army is so ineffective coming against us that we may as well just kind of let them... let things happen. Brave souls to push towards us, but I'm afraid it will cost them in the end. So there goes that cavalry contingent. Gotta keep an eye on where their reinforcements come in. Let's just strain you guys out. Who's going to hit the line first? Oh, 
You're forming up, which is very brave. There you go, we've, bro we've destroyed one of their units. Pick another. there. I mean, if it looks like all they're going to do is just reorganize their line over and over again. Push out. Push forward. There you go. Getting some pot shots off of this. Oh, they're in a bit of a death for laid. Now they're pushing up towards us. Aha! Go get him. Yep, the carabiner is part of the line now. the conscripts. Let's bring a regiment of force over here. Eh, yeah, you'll probably be fine. Let's just try and shatter some units just so they definitely don't come back. Kill the enemy general. Hey, the 8th regiment's pushed us. Push the armed citizenry. Kill the entire enemy generator. Is anyone else coming in? Apparently not. Yeah, some of them are coming in towards the rear. I'll just give them an order to push all the way through the town. You men push up, try and engage that citizenry. Okay, good, good, good. You are shattered. Yeah, it looks like they're going to be coming in from back over here instead. Artillery engage the citizenry. Newman engage the general's bodyguard. All of these guys push through the town. We might need a regiment of horse back just in case they screw us. Excellent. Engaging the general. Yeah, they're coming in from back here. That's fine. Killed another enemy general. So we're pushing, pushing their back corner. Move forward. Ah, what the hell. Move the guns up. You may engage the conscript. That'll just bog them down at least. Bring the general up. Let's 
anyone else coming in? Apparently not. Yeah, you're routing. Bring the cavalry back to our line. It's only that poor militia unit. Kind of a waste of time, really, to limber my guns up, but why not bring them over? Smash the 20th! Smash him! Yeah, you better do some shooting. The heavy cavalry are not going to take kindly to you. Bring my cavalry back. Everyone's just going to push up and must get them to hell and back. No style, no intelligence, no finesse. Good old fashioned fun. Let's see if they chase after my cavalry. If I push them forward. Yes, you better position yourselves ready. You might want to you want to make sure you don't don't uh, get yourself a mischief. Forty seventh. Oh. This could be so painful for them. Yep, kill some of my guys. And you will stand stoically ready. Everyone's making ready. Oh, Twenty men killed. That's them done. What about you fellows? <laughs> yeah, unsurprisingly, as soon as they get fired upon, you know what? This is a bad idea. Let's not do this. Good, good, good. Nice. That is Genoa knocked out. Bye-bye. Bastia is taken. No. Excellent. So you men replenish. So we're ready to move on, Turin. Because you're in position. And we've got plenty of troops defending our frontier towns. Ready to jump on Tripoli. Ready to jump on Jerusalem. I mean, I might even bring you down as well. I mean, so many of these fellows just aren't going to be required. Get these mercenaries up towards St. Petersburg. It's going to take them many, many turns to get there. Mind the port or repair the port. You're replenishing. Everyone's pushing. Everyone's moving. Good. Like I said, the only territory that well, the only territory that's not immediately under threat is Sarajevo, but we've got to take Zagreb first. The twins are defending it, but let's hit and turn. Troops in Mysore are being recruited that are completely unnecessary. Oh, for God's sake, AI! They've pushed out of Croatia. So he's pushed out of Croatia. Sarajevo is well within reach. And the only territory they've got really resisting is Vienna. So they've pulled an army out of a city. And as a result, their empire's going to be destroyed. Okay, they've built, they've boosted the defence of Sarajevo moderately. But not enough. Are you getting ideas about your station, Saxony? I wonder. They're getting up to no good. I mean, they probably hate me. As a hate me as a colonial power, not me personally. 
Oh yeah, I think Austria is going to get knocked out this turn. Two of their cities are going to collapse. Then we're going to take Austria itself, wipe them out. Ooh, you raided farmland. Very brave of you. But now, yoink. That's Zagreb. Don't really care about the fleet. Their fleet doesn't matter anymore. New town emerges. This town. Okay, let's get on with the building, just because I do like building. Let's get all the stuff in Syria done. I believe that's it, because the roads are done. Morea. Rumalia. Do all the building in Istanbul. Nice. Greece, you've got a lot of stuff to do. Actually, not too much stuff. Hungary. I mean, we are going to build this because uh, that army will not exist in next turn and will not stop us. Uh, get a craft workshop. Emperor upgrade. Make Anchor a good Christian state. I mean, for the most part, we'll, we will reach a point where we just start upgrading things as and when. As and when we see them, we're not going to keep doing it. Really, it's the roads I just need to keep on top of. Uh, but yeah, Sarajevo is well within our grasp. Taking Zagreb. Sarajevo will be taken, and then we might even do an old switcheroo, just to make sure my good army is, make sure my good army is actually doing the assault. Because Mr. Figo, you men can replenish. But yeah, these guys, that's a big, big mistake. Lots of recruitment. Yeah, we took Croatia, let's take Sarajevo because they've got two mortars so they might cause some trouble uh, but the army itself is this Austria is a shell of a state they have one main army in the field and they have deployed it appallingly and it will cause the downfall of their empire I mean they couldn't really defend Vienna because you've got too many forces there but they appear determined to go down fighting so you've got some bugged field artillery all of my artillery blast round sh blast with uh, yeah with round shot. So they're going to be just trying to hit their howitzers. Group all my cavalry and my bug general's bodyguard on one flank. They have cavalry on this flank, but don't really mind. New men might just cease. Just actually, two units will halt so they can engage the 18 light, 18 light horse. Form square. Let them charge the square. Push you men up around the flank. Yeah, move in. Get my company cavalry to flank around a bit. Actually, even might blast this and as well. Focusing on the Gurkhas of all things. Okay, right, get you men in. They both smash the armed citizenry. Get my general in there as well. Get my howitzers to start 
quick climbing, some of these. Oh god, the mortars are getting obliterated. Just go get him, I suppose. Company cavalry's a bit stuck out here. Focus on these this cluster. Send in my company cavalry and flank around and get the mortars. The Urkers are going after the mercenaries, they'll clear them out. Excellent. Hack them to pieces. And then all my artillery ceasefire. Destroyed another, destroyed a house. First regiment will go down pretty quick. There they go. Keep packing them down. Then charge into the rear of the militia. Slaughter them. <laughs> yeah, it's the end of Sarajevo. They're just losing too much stuff too fast. They just can't can't handle it. They can't hack it. I mean the territory is so undeveloped. Hey look, just push more men up towards the towards the next battle area, I suppose. Roads. Yeah, just keep moving up to the next area. There's no point trying. There's no point positioning to fight against fight against Austria because they're not gonna not gonna happen. You know what? Let's try and assassinate their general. Twenty one percent. Got him. <laughs> and it looks like the other general that was here, his twin brother, he died of natural natural causes. But yeah, Matthias Pinto. He's been here some time. Let's go take... What? What? <laughs> I went... I, I attacked the general. That's just stupid. Alright then. Well, this is, this is definitely happening, so... Alberto Salazar, you've also been here a while. You will have the honour of attacking Vienna. Because I accidentally sent an army to run over and effectively molest a uh, agent, a religious agent. I just ran over to him, told him to get out of my way. And that was that. Oh, goddamn misclicks. I mean, I could have used the Austrian army, or the Hungarian army, but you know what? Nah. Nah. Let's use a good, a good, proper, full-strength army that we can just obliterate the heck out of the enemy. Work on our breaches, quick line the mortars in the center if we can. If not, we may have to figure out another way. We've got a got a good artillery to make a breach. Pikemen plus a block of very veteran infantry to go in one breach. Some infantry to go into another. Grenadiers and Frontiers meant to go on the right. Cavalry spread out, take advantage of wherever the gaps arise. Because yeah, they've got a lot of a lot of mortars in there, it'd be useful just to clear these out somewhat. That there we go down to seven crew. Sadly, one of them. Imagine to uh, 
get away with get away with some mischief because the command HQ is acting as a barrier. It will not serve. Look at this, the 11th Regiment. Although the Heath is a very early army. Apart from these guys, the 150th and the 11th and 13th. 10th. These men have fought with us all the way. Oh, they're firing back. They're engaging the pikes. Get spread out. Finally, some good hits. Killed eight more to crewmen. Some short rounds. We got ten crew, seven crew. I mean, it says four out of four, so these guys may. <laughs> it's got to fit to be doing. He's just having a little dance. Okay, let's speed up time. Yeah, still cracking away. Once we've got our breach, we're going to start quick climbing the troop trying to defend it as we move towards the next breach. Reload, fire. Any mortars that we can slow down. Oh, there we go. We've lost 14 crew. That's pretty good. Hey, horse guards here, I don't really care about. Excellent. So the new men can pivot your guns and attack here. One of the howitzers focus on attacking this block of troops behind it. Another howitzer continue. Oh, I killed an entire mortar unit. That's pretty good. Hit here. No, the dancing officer. <laughs> But I'll never finish. I'll never finish my performance. Oh, wrong way. Come on. I can't, get, I can't look right down on top of him. Oh, it's not letting me do it. I have to go back here. Gats. <laughs> Ooh. 200 militia and one hit. And some more. Four crew. I mean, yeah, these guys, their mord threat is significantly diminished. You know what? Let's just push in. To heck with the, with the breach. These gunners can smack the breach with shot. These men are going to scale the walls and be supported by grenadiers as my skirmishes. Oh no, I've got to take the gate. There's a militia unit there, they're in the way. Quick climb, just hack at these guys in the centre. So, three guns firing, three compared to twelve. That's pretty good. Exceptional hits. Yeah, it's going to thin them out. Quick climb, knock a few more holes in the enemy. Let's try to secure the wall here, knock out this militia unit and my light infantry. Oh, 
do something like this. So we're making good. We're going to make good progress up on the wall. We're going to definitely swamp the Swiss grenadiers. Hitting the pikes. Here comes the quick climb. Let's put put the uh, pikemen inside. The U men attack the blunderbuss shotguns on the top. The U men attack the Swiss Grenadiers. Yeah, the pike. If the pikes break because of their artillery fire, that's fine. I only, was only going to send them in to suck up some fire. Yeah, they want to come out. So you men ceasefire. Sound is being funky. Blunderbuss shotgunners are a good target. This infantry knock out the Swiss grenadiers. Scale the wall. Don't just stand there attacking the wall. Get up here, attack them, kill them. The pikes are going to slow down. I mean, we've got the chug because they're now pushing out of the gate. When the Grenadiers get up here, they're going to definitely help. I mean, is it you guys, this unit here? So we give you an alternative order. Do you not freak out? Is it? Is it actually this breach? So if I run my pikemen away, I'm not sure what it is. Why don't you just give up attacking? The rationale is if I just kind of make everything a little bit easier. I think you guys are, are you guys stuck? Just run away. See if we can ease things a little bit, because you're not attacking. We pull away from you guys attacking. You guys aren't attacking either. Come on, run away, pikeman. Actually, you know what? Just to make things a little bit faster. These pike units open fire. So either the pikemen run away or they get shot at. Either way, I don't care. What is causing... I, I mean, I'm pretty sure it's going to be these guys, right? There we go. Okay, now you men can go after the blend of our shotgunners. come out and kill us or try and kill us everyone else can continue fighting we're gonna knock out the swiss grenadiers new men charge across and go kill the militia on the wall there we go you men open up. Artillery just slam here. See, sometimes when the game 
the game itself just wants you to have a miserable time and at which point you have to kind of say you know what I'm not gonna let you give me and make me have a miserable time let's just let one unit attack the grenadiers lots of quick climb refocus on the refocus on the breach We take this gatehouse. And we're frontiersmen might not really help, but it might help the numbers. Kill the last grenadiers. Saw someone flying around. Fifth Regiment are charging out. Very brave of them, but foolish. Excellent. Get in here. Get in here. Capture that gatehouse. Get in here. Quite sure why you're going that way, because there's a way in right here, but whatever. You keep pushing. There we go, tribal auxiliary, go kill the 15th. Here I see air, go kill the mortar, the howitzers. These guys <laughs> cease your plan to just run in because you've got. They have sent you to bung it up, so I'll cover some cavalry and some pikes will clear it out. But for the most part, we have our breach. You men start the count. Killing the mortar crews. Make sure my grenadiers keep attacking the militia. Let's just try to get my frontiersmen just out of the way. They were useful, we needed bodies to secure the wall. He's an incredibly veteran grenadier. They were letting him shoot people, they weren't killing him. I just killed another of my compadres. Gain some more experience for it. Come on. Bonk him in the back of the head. Got him. Oh, and we've smacked him around the face with the gun as well. You guys get this morty. Oh, they're dead. Oh, everyone's breaking. Yep, everyone broke. A valiant effort, a fair effort, I think, for them. Um, but they were just screwed from the get-go. Nice. So that is Vienna secured and Austria destroyed. See you later, Austria. Let's get everything repaired. They're, oops, they're really upset. But once we get rid of the university, that's going to really help. everything repair we don't we don't really need um, fishing oh, markets but right so what we want to do is scope out Savoy what have you got bunch of fifths bunch of brigs We're going to want to smash him. You know what? Just bring, bring, uh, bring a load of my ships over here. <laughs> Sweden won't get involved. But yeah, if we can smash this fleet, we'll open the road to Cairo. 
you'll hop on to okay i think i might start this now well there's no point waiting get going get upgrading you're a bit that's a bit concerning but eh. okay So many heavy pets. Serpent Amos, they call him Amos. He was fishing in the Louisiana swamp, so I've heard, according to Jerry Reed. Right, push them up. Because yeah, Sweden's got Sweden's got ships. We're gonna need to go in and destroy them. Okay, let's bring another fleet over. Another fleet over. <laughs> May as well do something with them. Nearly 100% Catholic in Algiers. Yeah, it may as well just kick it off, I think. Say, hey, cheer in. Oh, let's see if Sweden joins them. Terrifying. Spectacular. Yeah, I don't think they're on the same level as us. Saxony's joined us. Sweden hasn't joined them. Cheer in. Under siege. Tripoli will likely fall. Well, it will fall without a fight because they have no one defending it. Excellent. They've got an army here, but they're not going to be very useful. Jump on Jerusalem. You can get ready to jump on them as well. You're on your way north. Can you guys leave Petrus? You can. You men get embarked. Post has come through the door. Right, let's get you, and you go here. See this fleet get over here as well. Just bring ships across. New town emerges. Building, construction, we've done all that. Right, well, with all of these ships, let's just say we're going to go go get them. <laughs> I mean, it's incredibly unfair, I get it, but man, I want to see it. But looking at the timer, I believe it's time to end the episode. So, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for the beginning of the end of the Savoy Empire. Cheers, everyone. <laughs>